Learn Inc. for engineering courses. Operators in C. In this video, we are going to discuss about operators in C. Objectives Operators in C. Arithmetic operators, relational operators, special operators. Operators in C. The symbols which are used to perform logical and mathematical operations in a C program are called C operators. These C operators join individual constants and variables to form expressions. Consider the expression a plus b multiplication of 5 where plus and multiplication are operators. a and b are variables, 5 is constant and a plus b multiplication of 5 is an expression. What are the different types of operators available in C? Types of C operators C language offers many types of operators. They are arithmetic operators, assignment operators, relational operators, local operators, bitwise operators, conditional operators that is ternary operators, increment or decrement operators, special operators. In this section, we will be discussing about arithmetic operators, relational operators, special operators. Arithmetic operators Arithmetic operators are used to perform many of the familiar arithmetic operations that involve the calculation of numeric values represented by literals, variables, other expressions, function, constants, and so on. For example, in real life, user want to add two values using counting the fingers and small stone. But in C language, user will use plus operator and form the expression using declared variable A and B. The plus operator used to add two values in an expression together. Automatically calculate the value and store into C variable. It subtract one from another with the minus operator. But in C language, user will use the minus operator and form the expression using declared variable A and B. C is equal to A minus B, that is 7 minus 5 is 2. C is 2. User want to multiply the two values using multiplication operator. For this example, C is equal to A multiply B, that is 7 multiply 5, the result is 35. Divide one number by another number using divide operator. 7 divided by 5 is 1.4. C is an integer variable so that it will convert floating value into integer value. Therefore, C value is 1. Modulo operator returns the integer remainder of a division. For example, 100 modulo 10 is equal to 0 because the remainder of 100 divided by 10 is 0. This program is used to explain how to return C program using arithmetic operator. First line is preprocessor directive statement which include definition of printf, scanf functions that is linked to the standard library input or output functions. Second line also preprocessor directive used to link to the console input and output functions. From void main function program is started. Declare integer variable a is 10 and b is 100. Clear screen function to clear the screen. Directly calculate the a plus b that is 10 plus 100 addition operation inside the printf statement and this statement display the value 110. Calculate subtraction operation a minus b that is 10 minus 100 and printf statement will display the subtraction value is minus 90. Multiplication operation A multiply B that is 10 into 100 and the result is 1000. Printf statement display the multiplication value is 1000. Division operation B divided by A that is 100 divided by 10 and the result is 10. Printf statement display the division value is 10. 
Similarly, the modulo operation is performed and return the remainder value. Its result is 0. Printf statement display, the remainder value is 0. Get function is used to wait for user to exit from the program. Relational operators Relational operators are used to find the relation between two variables. Relational operators are equal, not equal, greater than, greater than or equal to, less than, less than or equal to. For example, compare two values using less than operator. Here, A is 5 and B is 10. Compare A less than B, that is, 5 less than 10. 5 is small value comparing 10, so that this condition is true. Now, compare two conditions at the same time, using less than or equal to operator. For example, if A is less than or equal to B, here A is 10 and B is 10. First, compare two values, A less than B or not. This condition is false and then check equal condition. Both values are equal, so that the result is true. Now, A is 5. This equal condition is not satisfied, but less than condition is true. Greater than operator checks if the value of left operand is greater than the value of right operand. If yes, then condition becomes true. Here, tree 1 height is 10 feet and tree 2 height is 8 feet. Comparing two trees height, the result is tree 1 height was greater than tree 2. Greater than or equal to operator checks if the value of left operand is greater than or equal to value of right operand. If yes, then condition becomes true. For example, if A is greater than or equal to B, that is 10 greater than or equal to 10. Now, comparing two values A greater than B or not, this condition is false and then check equal condition. Both values are equal, so that the result is true. This equal to operator is used to check the both operand values are equal or not. Where weight of the red apple is 20 gram and green apple weight also 20 gram. Both weight of the apples are equal. This not equal to operator is used to check the both operand values are not equal or not. Where Weight of the red apple is 20 gram, but pineapple weight also 450 gram. Both weight of the apples are not equal. Size of operator It is a unary operator which is used in finding the size of data type, constant, arrays, structure, etc. For example, size of int, where int has predefined value 2 bytes, so it will return 2 bytes. If size of character, it will return 1 bytes. Similarly, float will return 4 bytes and double will return 8 bytes. Following table is used to describe the data type and the size in byte, where highest size data type is long double and lowest size data type is character. Void data type is meaningless. For more programming in C videos, subscribe Learn Ing YouTube channel.